Hello, Colorado Springs business owners. I'm Pastor Brian Maples with Arise Church and fellow business owner here in Colorado Springs. I understand that business gets crazy and it can take tolls on your health and on your family and things like that if you don't keep it in check. I want to invite you to Arise Church as a place that's going to encourage you, build you up. We're not coming against you or your business. We believe in profit. We believe in you doing well and successful. But I also know that God has designed a connection for your business and the church together to take your business not only to a new level, but also give you influence and impact beyond what you had originally thought, beyond what is uh, normal for a business. God's got a purpose for your business. He's got design for your business, and He loves you too. We don't need you suffering with all the uh, things that are common amongst business people. I'm not even going to get into it. God doesn't want you sick. He doesn't want your family falling apart, and He doesn't want you to fail, flop, or decrease. God wants your business to grow just like you do. He wants you to remain profitable with ease. He wants to take the toil, the stress, and the strife out of your business. And he wants to empower you to do business well. But not only that, but he wants your business and you and you personally to influence other people and to have greater sphere of influence. And we want you to do things. And I can't dream it all up for you. That's not what I'm saying. But I can pray for you. We can let the Holy Spirit speak to you through preaching and teaching and things like that and getting your mind stayed on the Word and reminded of the Word because the Word of God is the key to success. If you think you're succeeding without the Word of God, you're absolutely wrong. You're working on godly principles and the way to uh, strengthen those and to understand those better and to work in those better is to spend time in the Word of God. Do you need a church? Not to be connected to God, but do you need a church? Yes, it's God's design. It's God's system for getting encouragement to you. It's God's system to keep stress from wreaking havoc on your body. It's God's system designed to keep it your business from running your life to where you run it. We hear these quotes, but nobody can really tell us how to do it. It's because it's in God's Word. We must combine faith and business. They were never meant to be separated. So you'll get a lot of that. And once again, I want to tell you, I know motivation is important. Positive thinking is important. You got to get the, especially for you entrepreneurs that are building something and growing stuff. It's important that you get fed good stuff. We're not going to tear you down. We're not going to tear down your business. You will be encouraged, but you'll be encouraged the right way. You'll have godly motivations and you'll be able to have life abundant, life overflowing. That's what Jesus came to give us. You know, when Jesus was talking with Peter about his fishing business, Peter came to Jesus and said, we have stressed out, toiled, worked our butts off all night long. We're tired. We just want to wash our nets and get to bed because that was a complete waste of time. I lost money, lost all this stuff. Jesus said, go back out there, go out there, cast your net out there. Now that Jesus was involved, and it was just a simple little word from Jesus, go back out, cast your net. And they said, we've tried this. We fished this spot for all night long, all this other stuff. Jesus said, just go out, cast your net. So they listened to him. They go out there. The first net that they cast out was so full of fish, they couldn't even get it into one boat. They had other boats coming, other of uh, Peter's business's boats coming to help them coming in. And it filled up multiple boats with one catch. That's the difference that having a godly connection in your life uh, makes in your business. And I'm telling you, it's God's design that you get encouraged by other believers, not just myself. You know, I'm not just talking about, I've got all this great business advice and stuff like that. I've got some and I've got a little bit of experience. But what I do have is a gift to influence, to speak God's word and God's truth and him and you are going to make that thing happen. And he's going to use me sometimes to speak that truth to you, to say something that just makes something click for you. It's just the way it works. Any of you who know me know I'm not a manipulator. I'm not doing this to try and manipulate anybody, but I believe in God's gift in you, and I believe in God's gift in me, and I believe in God's church, and I believe in God's business it's an influencer in every area of life. So whether it's business, arts, entertainment, government, education, whatever you're involved in, 
even if you're involved in another church. I invite you to connect with us, check us out, see how we can partner. If nothing else, let us pray for you and bless your business. Thanks for listening. Brian Maples with Arise Church. You can check us out on Facebook, facebook.com slash Arise Church Colorado or Arise Church. That's a website. Arise Church, C-H-U-R dot C-H. Thanks. Bye.